Hi guys. Um, I know no one really watches this channel, but if you do, I kind of want to take some time and explain what the True Art Project is, how I'm going to move forwards, um, new videos, all, all that stuff. So, uh, for the most part, I am, if you don't know what this channel is, I'm a singer-songwriter, um, not a very good one uh, <laughs> at either of those things, hence the views, but uh, I keep trying, and this channel is just kind of my hobby, it's where I put videos for fun, um, but anyway, I kind of wanted to explain what I've been doing. So, what's been happening is this thing called the True Art Project, and that was, that was there was three of those. Um, I might continue it in the future, I don't know where I'm going to go, but the True Art Project was basically... I didn't want any pressure on myself as a creator, and I just wanted to see what I would do. So I didn't want to have to feel like I had to shoot an incredible video or record incredible audio, and it made it a lot easier to produce content. And I also was coming at it from a perspective of the music industry as a whole has a lot of confines on their music that they make. And what I mean by that is that if you're an artist and you're trying to fit into a genre, typically you have to write and play for that genre. So like if you're writing for a pop song, your song should be like two minutes and 30 seconds to like four minutes. And then it should be about uh, a, a significant other and use lots of words like you and, uh, very undescriptive language that makes it, it almost makes the song less personal and more personal to every other person which is why the music genre works but less personal to you and so I kind of had this idea that was like what if I take uh, I, I take that and then I just ignore all the rules and I just write what I want to write and I write what's personal to me and I write uh, with words that don't really make sense and I, I want to play some distortion on my guitar and just just a lot of stuff and sort of through that process I found um, I, I was starting to have a lot of fun with this channel again because originally the concept for this entire channel was I was going to every time after a shower, I was going to upload a quick video from my phone. And I did that for about a month. <laughs> and then I started wanting to make bigger and bigger projects, right? And so I started like filming little impromptu music videos as a way to learn how to edit. And uh, it, it was a lot of fun. I had a lot of fun, especially with the In My Blood song. Um, that wasn't a great video, but my god, I worked for probably a month and a half trying to get my voice to be able to like stretch to some of those notes in that song. And um, I look back and that's the one I'm most proud of. As far as songwriting, I am most proud of... Uh, <laughs> a song called Struggles, which I wrote about my two roommates in my previous apartment. And I just, I love this channel. I love looking back on it and reflecting on it. And yeah, so I just figured I would explain to you what the videos are. And then going forward, I do have some ideas. I want to keep this channel alive, but I'm also not going to put a lot of pressure on myself to do so. I just want to keep churning out videos and churning out content. So um, with that in mind, I think that probably I'll be doing a couple videos a month. Maybe they'll be covers, maybe they'll be originals, just depending on how I'm feeling. And yeah. All right. Anyway, that's been it. I hope you guys, wherever you are in the world, you're safe and happy and healthy. And uh, hang 10. Later, guys.